द ब्लॉग्स शॉपिंग वेबसाइट सोशल मीडिया अकाउंट और ओ टी टी सब्सक्रिप्शन दैट यू कैनॉट लिव विदाउट ऑल नीड अ यूजर आई डी एंड पासवर्ड Passwords are not just a hassle to remember but also a ubiquitous vulnerability across technologies. In a world of powerful computers and artificial intelligence, no amount of special characters or length can guarantee password security. That's where a passkey comes in. Google in its recent blog post termed it as the beginning of the end of the password. Passkeys allow users to log into the Gmail accounts the same way they unlock their mobile devices. This includes PIN and pattern locks or biometrics such as fingerprint or face ID. Passkeys are resistant to online attacks such as phishing. This Google says makes them safer than two-factor authentications. In the past few years, both Microsoft and Apple have launched their own version of passkeys. Let us understand from Deloitte India's Anand Venkataraman the technical differences between passkeys and passwords. The basic difference between a passkey and a password password has been there for a very long time. It is something that we know as a shared secret with somebody who we give it to, right? Most of the cases it's going to be the server on the other side or the application on the other side. which has what we know and we authenticate ourselves that's a password technology but in pass key there is nothing that is actually transmitted everything is done through a cryptography across two devices so basically you register yourself with your mobile phone which is typically the device that we all of us uses and based on that pure device authentication we are able to authenticate to an application or a service online so that's a key difference and nothing gets transmitted the one that goes back is a response to a challenge that is posted which is signed by the cryptographic key that we already have and that is unhackable so far when you type in passwords the verification takes place in servers in unknown locations around the world this makes passwords susceptible to online attacks like phishing and brute force attacks experts say passkeys are safer because they verify the login details in the user's device itself and use public key cryptography According to Google, since passkeys are bound to a website or app's identity, they're safe from phishing attacks. Although Apple and Microsoft lead the way in passkeys, Gmail is the most widely used email client in the world today, which is used to sign up for multiple other subscriptions. This essentially means that with Google's launch of passkeys, there will be a higher rate of adoption. But will this accelerated adoption lead to better security and less online attacks? what typically happens in a password what happens we need to understand that as well is that we put in a username and then a password and this is then sent to the end service which could be an application or a banking application whatever it might be typically when phishing happens they kind of divert um, and and they take that username and password and then they are able to use it on the legitimate side in case of passkey once you are registered using a mobile phone or any other device there are multiple options um there is a public key uh, encryption that stays with the service provider and the private key is stored within your mobile nobody else has your mobile and what happens is by way of a challenge that comes it could be a qr code that needs to be scanned to basically validate that you have your mobile phone with you and that answer or that qr code which is scanned is getting signed or encrypted with your private key tech giants google apple and microsoft have developed support for their passkeys in collaboration with fast identity online alliance or fido alliance fido is a global authentication standard based on public key cryptography its board level members include giants such as amazon american express alphabet intel meta and others with passkeys being adopted is there a possibility of a world without passwords here's what himanshu pathak of cyberx9 has to say at this stage it is uh, quite uneasy to say anything like that because the main thing is adoptability of technology how many applications are going to be adopted with this technology uh, okay google is adopting it partners of google will be adopting it but will twitter be adopting this technology will facebook be adopting this technology so it depends upon how the market reacts and how people are moving towards that technology to this pass keys and all if the market accept this then of course the password thing will be eliminated 
While pass keys are seamlessly integrated and are more secure, experts say users will still have to remember their master passwords. However, it is believed that the number of passwords required by users will decrease significantly. It also remains to be seen if all platforms on the internet will be willing to integrate pass keys into their systems. If you like this video, share it and subscribe to Business Standard. For more news, views and insights, log on to www.business-standard.com. Do also follow us on YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Telegram and LinkedIn.